everybody. It's been a little while. I'm going prodding today for the first time this season. So we're going to splash the little rowboat. We're going to row out there, throw at least one prawn trap over the side, and come back tomorrow to check it. So stay tuned. Let's go catch some prawns. Okay, just got to sight. Be racing against the clock here. It's getting dark. Should probably be on the uphill side of this. Oh well. I'd miss doing this. This is nice. Well, it looks like that hard uh, impact from sliding it down the ramp may have uh, cracked the bow a little bit. I'm taking on water, but I think I'll get it done and get back to the shore before it becomes an issue. So we're out here, sitting in a boat. 230 feet of water, just going to bait the trap and send it out. I got some uh, salmon roe that I couldn't catch any coho with, so I saved it for a few months and now we're going to put it in the prawn trap. If that doesn't bring them in, I don't know what will. Like, look at that, I, I'd almost eat that. Okay, it's, uh, it's time to send it. Wish me luck! Okay, sitting on the bottom, lots of slack, lead line, I'm going to throw it in and make sure that's tied on there nice and good. First prawn trap out in the season, hope it works out. And even though I'm taking on water, I think I've got time. Enjoy one of these. So thanks for watching so far and uh, we're gonna come back tomorrow. We're gonna pick it up and hopefully there's some prawns. Thanks for watching. Cheers. We're prawning. Awesome. See you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, what's up? It is the next day and let me tell you, it is raining freaking hard today. But we got a prawn trap to pull and I'm going to set an additional trap. So we're just about at the beach and stay tuned. I hope there's prawns out there, but we're going to go find out. So I'm getting set up to roll back out. As you can see, it's not a beautiful day. Pretty rainy, a little windy, but we're going for it. So I figure I might as well bait my trap now while I'm at the beach and it's easy. And then uh, we're going to roll out and go catch some prawns. So I stabbed the hell out of one of them, and then with the other one I'd stab it just a couple times, so that's like the sustained release one. And then the first one that I really stabbed is like the lets out a bunch of scent right away. That's my theory anyways. Maybe I'll do it on the ground so I don't stab it. We're all baited. Let's go.
Okay, I'm off the beach, out and away, and it is not very nice out here, I'm not gonna lie. Prawns don't care, they're already wet, they don't care about rain. So let's go catch some prawns. Freaking bends. You guys see District 9 or is it District 8? Freaking Prince! Shoot the fucking Prince! I always think of that uh, South African guy yelling about prawns. wind is that it's an onshore wind. So, if I do get into trouble, my corpse should just wash back up on shore. So, I got that going for me. About halfway out. Okay, it's not very not very nice out here, but I got to a spot that's going to be suitable. I'm not going to push it today. I'm going to deploy this trap and then go pick up the other one. Okay, we're there. You guys can see first. Woo! Okay. All right. That is not a bad haul. That is awesome. Okay, good. I'm gonna set it real quick before I get too close. Yes. Okay, if I can make it safely back to shore, call this a success. BC spot prawn in a little rowboat. Ah, oh, it's awesome. Woo, freaking prunes. A couple little shrimp, let them go. Shrimp with eggs, good luck out there. I rode back out, rebaited the trap, I'm gonna throw it out, and then we got two soaking, so next time should be even better. Well, I made it safely back to the beach which is a bit of a relief. Next time, I'll definitely wait for a better weather day, but you know what, we did it. We got some prawns in the boat, and I'm uh, gonna have a good dinner tonight. So thanks guys for watching, I hope you enjoyed it, and we'll catch you next time. Peace out.